like, watch a video or two, and subscribe if you will. Diecast Clown, we'll diecast by the bay here on Saturday morning. Beautiful day. Got my coffee. Still waiting on my Andre Cruz coffee, but, but uh, not much to go over this this week. Kind of a small weekly haul, but um, an expensive one at that. Uh, first up. Um, Team Transport number 44, the LB ER 34 Super Silhouette Nissan Skyline and uh, Fleet Street. Um, nothing you guys haven't already seen. Very nice, as all of these are. And unfortunately, I ordered a case, and um, it came with two of these to the show. Not my favorite one, but that's what it is. I would have much had, rather have two of these other two. Up next, the 1972 Plymouth Cuda with a retro rig. that I didn't have the um I don't have the previous three that were released I guess it would be 43 42 and 41 I don't know how I missed out on those but uh, I'll try and I'll try and order them and see if anybody's got them left um kind of heavy on the square bodies this week not really but I uh, picked up uh three the case of the team transport and the next two castings I'm going to present, I ordered from SC Diecast. Uh, up next, we got an Auto World, the Cha 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 Muldowney square body. I'm trying to look for a year on this one. It doesn't have it. Itself is very nice, beautiful casting, but it's a truck. Work on those tires, Auto World. Come on, you should have big, beefy tires, not these narrow ones. But anyway, it's still a nice casting. Uh, up next, we got the Auto World. Miho exclusive Betsy special edition on a 4800. Uh, we all know how I feel about that. The 1980 Chevy Silverado. Now this one is gorgeous. nonetheless. Up next, I know I already had this. As a matter of fact, I have a couple of these, but um, I picked up yet another one, the 1984 Chevy Silverado 10 fleet side uh, from Motor World. 
pick this up. Uh, I'm gonna send this to a friend. It's nice. I, s I already have one packaged up for another friend. And I have two for myself, actually. Are uh, just main lines that I picked up. Uh, picked up another one of the Corvette C8R. Then and now, this is very nice. I do like this one. One of these days, guys, I'll find a super. Toss it right there in the bay for you. Next, picked up um, another. Actually, I picked up two more of the 1940 Ford pickup. We've all seen it. And, uh, I think somebody can make a mean custom out of this. I might actually attempt to do a custom with this one here. But uh, that. One of these is actually getting sent off to somebody as well. And again, I picked up two more of the Nissan Skyline 2000 GTR, the Liberty Walk. Not bad casting. I was actually very thankful to come across another one of these because I only had one prior to this one. And that is the 1965 Mustang 2 Plus 2 Fastback. Now this one is my favorite one in the 2 by 2 plus 2 fast pack that they have released thus far but uh, definitely needs a wheel swap i think the color is nice just needs uh, different shoes if you will and the last three like i said guys this is a short haul small haul but yet still an expensive one because that case of Team Transports was $60, and then the two Auto World castings were 20, 20 or 25 bucks a piece plus shipping. You know, it gets expensive, but uh, not complaining. Just letting you know why this haul this week was kind of small. Up next, got the 1969 Dodge Charger 500. gray with orange racing stripes. I'm not a big fan of those uh, wheels and tires that they chose, but uh, it's a nice casting. Unfortunately, this was the only one that I came across. Uh, this one as well. Eventually, I guess I'll find another. Uh, up next, the McLaren Elva. Uh, new for 2022. Again, this was the only one. Would have picked up multiples of this one just to have to send to people, but um, it was the only one on the bank, so I grabbed it. It's okay. New for 2022. And then last but not least, the uh, 1968 El Camino in uh, Hot Wheels Speed Shop. Got the Rod Squad. And we've all seen, you know, the engine in the back, but um, this one's not as bad on this El Camino. I don't know if, uh, you know, the, if I can use the term it was done tastefully, but... Um, not as obnoxious as we have seen in previous released El Caminos. So, it's nice. I'll take it. And I did. Well, I guess um, I'd have to say that my favorite from this week that one of 4,800, but uh, 
Uh, this is it's very nice. The detail is phenomenal, to say the least. I really do wish I picked up another one of these, but um, uh, 20 bucks. Kind of steep. That doesn't make sense when you pick up you know, a case of the team transports for 60 bucks. Hmm. I guess if I could have, I definitely would have wanted two of one of the two of these instead of the Porsche. Uh, don't get me wrong, the Porsche is still nice. I like that uh, it's red on one side and yellow on the other. Just not my favorite. But, um, that's about it, guys. Short video today, and that's okay. Because, um, got things to do. Enjoy yourselves today. Peace out, Clown Nation.